Mrs. Crow on a, yet again, a very blustery day. And we are on Poppy's porch and I am with Howard. You know Howard. And we have a new friend. This guy right here, his name is Zachary. He's also a bunny. And How Howard, well, Howard, where are you going? I don't know where Howard's going. I don't know what's up. Well, hi, Miss Cookie. Hey, Miss Crow. How are you? Oh, I'm doing well, doing well. Well, what are you up to today? Uh, well, I, I, I saw you talking, and I, I think we might have us a little problem. Oh, no. We have a problem? Yeah, I think the problem is, uh, where the problem? Oh, uh, uh, where the problem is, we have not done our chair yet. Oh, well, that is true. That is very true. Well, yeah, that, that is a problem, too. Why don't you somethings at home? Why don't you all grab your own somethings and we're gonna do our cheer and we're gonna say, we're, we're not nothing, nothing. We're, we're something. <laughs> Thanks, George. Oh, absolutely. Maybe that'll all put us on the same page. Oh, I'm a problem solver today. <laughs> oh, good. We all need problem solvers. Well, right, why don't right. you go find Dog? Oh, I can do that for you. I'm solving the problem. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, George. Oh, For Zachary's going to hang with me for a little while, and I'm still a little worried. I don't know where Howard went, but, oh, I don't know. For Zachary doesn't know either. Oh, well. Well, while we're talking about what we're doing today, I think the letter of the day should be R. And we're going to make that because one of our one of our hidden words for our hidden sentence is room another one is make and then another one is more and then another one is four George is gonna hide those around and remember you guys have to unscramble those words so dog what do you think's going on today Ooh, well I know exactly what we do mm-hmm so, what is it? Ha, we doing a play. We are. Uh -huh, we doing a some playhouse today. <laughs> I love something playhouse. Do you have a star for your show? Ooh, the star, the one, the only, is Mr. Vazakali. Vazakali, Vazakali. All right. Well, we're gonna get ready. What's it? What is the name of our play? Oh, the name of the play is. You can make soup from a stone. Hmm. Who knew? Huh. Well, are you going to go get ready? Oh, uh, yeah. I'll be right back. Okay. So, dog, what are we up to? The something playoffs! <laughs> well, I think that's exciting. Did you direct this play? Oh, well, you know, I, I know it a little bit, but I know you know it a lot better. Mm -hmm. I might. I've read it a few times, haven't I? Yeah, just a few. Just a few. So who's the star of the show today? Ooh, the star of the show is the one, the only, Fruzakale! Oh, there he is! <laughs> the crowd goes, ah! <sighs> right. Are you ready to begin? Oh, let's begin. That's a good All idea. Right. Mm -hmm. Once upon a time... There was a weary traveler, and he was very hungry. Are you hungry for Zachary? But all he had was a stone. So he thought, maybe, maybe I can find someone that will make soup with me. And so he proceeded down the road with his stone, and he found a person, dog, and he he was stirring a pot, but there was nothing, there's nothing in the pot. Nope. So, nope, there's nothing in the pot. So, Zachary brings along his stone and says, I can make soup from this stone. What pot? And so he puts the stone in the pot. <laughs> well, he sits and waits and along comes another traveler, and this particular traveler has an onion. And so, the, the Zachary watches, and when 
this one comes up with the onion, he says, why don't you put that in? Because we're making stone soup. And we one says, no, you can't make soup from a stone. But it started to smell good. And so Doc says, who knew you could make soup from a stone? Well, Wee One goes and he waits because he's smelling very good and he'd like some of Zachary's soup. And so along comes Little Bear and Little Bear comes in and Little Bear has salt. And he sees and he smells and it smells delicious. And so he looks at Dog and says, would you like salt from your soup? Oh, please, 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 please. And so pours the salt into the soup. Who knew you could make soup from a stone? Who knew? <laughs> Who knew? Well, then along comes Dawn. Dawn's usually the first one on the scene, but she brings along celery to go in the soup. So over she goes and she says, Oh, this smells so good. Soup from a stone? Dog, did you know that would happen? You could make that? Zachary seemed to know. So in goes the celery. Mm, 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 mm. And this bowl is getting so full. And so Dawn goes away and she brings along a potato. Norman says, I think that should go in a stone soup. And so he puts it in. And then along comes, well, for Zachary had his own special problems. Well, problems, what problems? He had, oh, he had garlic. And he throws it in causes a windstorm. So it goes and it smells delicious. And they stir it and stir it and stir it. And Dog says, Who knew you can make soup from a stone? You know who knew? Fazakerly knew. Fazakerly. You sly dog. <laughs> and Fazakerly, you did a great job. Applause. Yay for the something playhouse. Well, oh, we will have our soup later. Well, thank you guys. I think we just dropped our soup. No! Oh, well, I think that we I'm going to clean it up. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. So while he's cleaning it up, we should talk about what number that we have today. And our number is... Well, 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 oh, Miss Crow. What? I still think we have a surprise. We do. Can we talk about the number just for a second? How many oh. things did I put into that bucket? Do you remember? I do. I put in six things. So I think the number of the day should be six. Let's count. Can we count? Oh, I, I can definitely count. Let's count. So we're going to start with one. one. Two, three, four, five, and six. Thank you. Now, I didn't forget. You think there's a problem? I still think there's a problem. Oh, no. Do you have any idea what it could be? Well, Sad Howard, he, he seems real sad. Do seem a little on the downside today, even more than usual. Is there a reason for that? Oh, are you a little jealous? You think there's not enough room for you? Oh, poor sad Howard. Well, Howard, you forget that you have a super somethingness that lives in you. Cookie, do you remember what his somethingness is? Oh, he is an expert listener. Uh-huh. He He's an expert listener. And he has these wonderful long ears. Oh, oh, yes, yes. For Zachary Lee has long ears too. But for Zachary Lee has his own talents. He's a little well, okay, he's a little showier, Howard, yes. Do you did you want to be the star of the show? Do you ever want to be the star of the show? He says, no, Cookie. So, well, oh, he thinks there's just not enough room for more than one bunny. Well, my mama used to say there's always room in the pot for one more potato. Ah, oh, 
that's true. When you have a whole lot of people, you can always throw another potato in the pot. I forgot that saying. Thanks, uh -huh. Cookie. That's a good saying. Well, Howard, do you feel a little bit better knowing that there's room for you? He says yes, and he actually would like to thank you, Cookie, for being aware of him. Of course, of course. Well, thanks, guys. Well, Howard, why don't you go play? But you know what? Take for Zachary with you. He's new. He doesn't know anybody here. Go introduce your new friend. And then they're going. Well, I think that we all worked together so well for that play. And we came up with, well, we came up with all of the things that we could do to make stone soup. But is that really what we were doing? Soup from a stone? Dog, are you back there? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm back here. We just got done cleaning up all that soup. I apologize. I did drop the soup. Oh, it happens, it happens. Accidents happen. It does. Well, I, I wanted to know, what did we learn from your play today? Oh, well, uh, I, I believe we learned that you can make uh, you can make something out of nothing. Uh-huh. You can. You can make something out of nothing. When you all work, what? Together. Together. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I like that. And mm -hmm. everybody brought something that made something beautiful. Ooh, I that like soup that. would have been so good. <laughs> it would have if I hadn't dropped it. <laughs> oh, well. Can you go find Norman? Oh, I can, I can, I can. He's, he's up there reading a the book right now. Oh, good. Uh, Norman! Norman! And so Norman's going to come out of the tree and we're going to go ten, nine, eight, seven, six, six five, five, four, three, three Two and one. Hi. Hey, Norman. Hi, guys. <laughs> it's Hi. good to see you. You too. Did you get to be in the play? Oh, I did. I did. I did. I'm so glad you did. You were very good, too. Oh, thank you. Well, what are you up here to do? Oh, um, uh, uh, the three things. And I think we should do them right now. Oh, boy. <laughs> they are be, be kind, kind, be strong. strong be something. <laughs> Thanks, Norman. Well, I hope you guys liked us, and if you did, please like and subscribe. And if you have something else to say, remember what Mrs. Thumper says. If you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. Bye now. Bye now.